Right, oh, hello everybody, welcome to Full Knob Latin, game number six against Orcs. I saw the icon and thought it was Ogres, so I was pretty happy, but um, not so happy now, but still got a TV advantage. I just I find it difficult getting Orcs, oh my god, he's got three tackle. He's got his he's got his orc thrower just to ruin my day. Three that's the thing, orcs can take early tackle, can't they? Whereas Chaos, etc. tend not to. He hasn't got a great record though, so fingers crossed. Get your nobblers out. His fucking throw is the best player in his team. <laughs> See, but that, that's exactly why you don't want an orc thrower, right? Because, because if you look at his, if you look at his thing, he's got thirty-four SPPs in that thrower. Now, if those thirty-four SPPs were, you know, nine here, nine here, twelve here, um, that's like thirty. Then all of a sudden, he's got, you know, he's got extra skills in his blitzers instead of fucking skills in his shitty thrower. So that's why I don't like it. There you go. <laughs> um, yeah, block troll. Nobla kryptonite. It is actually a blood tackle throw. It is Nobla kryptonite, isn't it? Goblins and halflings and ogres all start all struggle with dodge, and all get pwned by tackle. So yeah, blood tackle absolutely horrible. When did I lose faith in humanity? I don't know what you mean. I've um, but um, I've never had much faith in much much faith in humanity anyway, to be honest. So I don't know how much there was to lose. But there you go. Glorious. Glorious. Fuck the thrower. <laughs> Seventastic anniversary here. <laughs> Glorious. Thank you very much, Smoko. Thank you for staying fantastic. <laughs> Thank you very much. That's crazy, isn't it? Seven months. I can't believe we've been partnered for seven well more than seven months. Fucking crazy. Fucking crazy. He's got his Astral Grand Stadium. Little bastard. <laughs> I can see the point in the Astro Grand Stadium for Orcs, but still, for any Bashy team, I'd still rather go Elfgrass, just because if you take, you know, there's no point in your team taking more. Kaz, I didn't even see the stadium name, to be honest. There's no point in your team taking more Kaz on average than anyone else's, that everyone, everyone else. Like, you're not competing against the team you're playing in the match. You're competing against the records and teams of everybody else of the same race. So, um, I don't know, you know, like, I either want to take something and increase the survivability of my players or increase the likelihood of winning. And Astro Granite doesn't really do any, either of those two things, does it? The dump. Like, the, the prevent a throw rock one and the, and the ref one is, that, is what I'll take with this team. If I, if I ever save enough money to do it. But you know, it's a, that's a big if, isn't it? The way, the way it's going, loner army, loner army already. Um, after a few fucking games, but never mind. The dump, yeah, it's fair enough. He's probably on the sideline, wasn't he? Yeah, he is. I hate that it just ends and then there's grass. If it was all Astro Granite, it would be way better, in my opinion. Also, it should be lighter, because it should be like the uh, the second dead one, shouldn't it? So it should be lighter, the Astro Granite. Like the Dwarf team in Blood Bowl 1. And then um, it should it should extend outwards as well, in my opinion. Hello, Morgans. That's fair. That's fair, Pedro Jack. That's fair. I don't know, I don't know what happens with the uh, Elfgrass one. I don't know if that extends outwards or not. Maybe maybe it maybe it was because that was a just a recolor of the grass instead of uh, instead of having to have something different. I remember when you had to use this because there was no uh, there was no grid, 
So Astro Granite was the best upgrade because you actually got a grid with the Astro Granite. <laughs> it's a long time ago, isn't it, when you had to play like this with no skills on and no no grid. Fucking hell. The dark days was now it's it's fantastic, isn't it? Hello, how are you? Yeah, it is, isn't it? It's looking it's looking pretty good. It's just the the loss on the record is horrible, isn't it? But it's just crap because it, the loss wasn't bad. He was 6-0 and with a 90 TV advantage. And uh, I misplayed, of course. I played crap, but still. Even if I hadn't, it was, you know, there's no, there was no shame in losing that match, really. It's just, it's just shit because then you've got other people who can have vampires or whatever and never face a competent opponent in the first 12 games. So... Oh yeah, exactly. Yeah, ever, ever, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Don't dwell on it. <laughs> okay, I won't dwell on it. Sorry. The old throw may well win it. To be honest, there's only one guy you can get, isn't it? Which is the tackle ninety ball guy. Yeah, I was a bit. I was greedy, wasn't I? I was. Well, to be fair though, you can argue that I wasn't even greedy because I wanted to secure, I, I wanted to secure the uh, the ball after I stole it, didn't I? Which is why I wanted an extra player. Which is why I didn't want to. Uh, why I only wanted to make a, a one dice block instead of a two dice block. And then when you look at um, the later turn when I did steal it and didn't protect it, it got stripped, and he scored from it. So you could even argue that what I did was right. Um, and just the bad dice didn't back this up. But yeah, it was, oh, it was the right move to whiz. It was just, I should have probably made it the two dice blitz. Just so that I at least would have got the ball. And then, if he gets it back, he gets it back. <laughs> Good argue, but no one here. <laughs> Oh, he's got a tackle there, uh, guy ready to get knocked over. Both t two tackles ready to get knocked over. That's nice of him, isn't it? It's very nice of him. Getting his tackle is tied up for me. Add John. So he's got a bit of blow there with the add John line up. Yeah, Emperor Augustus. Yeah, you don't need you don't need to say that. I know already. That's what's gonna happen, right? So obviously, first thing that has to happen is he stands up, he goes back, he gets a whacking with my e blow onto a tackler. Two assists here. And I knew I'd only get a push. But at least he's in with two guys and he, his tackle can't do anything. Maybe I should have just pushed him away, but I thought, you know, tie up his tackle is, is, uh, is alright, isn't it? I guess I could have just left with the orc, with the uh, war dancers, couldn't I have gone for a 2D on the ball? And G5 for the sixth quite a while, is that it? <laughs> it's probably sadly true. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have, uh, probably shouldn't have um, put that guy there, because I could have just put him in a row. But, but then if I just pushed him, I'd have still been based by the black orc, right? So that that was that actually was my thinking now that I, now that I remember. <laughs> so yeah, at least at least the tackle is. 
kind of. Like he could blitz with a ball carrier, but it's pretty fucking stupid, isn't it? He's the one that's made the GFI so far. Make the one turner a bit, a bit scarier, won't it? If I've got to go for it. Unbelievable, yeah, yeah, Sean. I couldn't yesterday. I shouldn't have played the second game either, because I knew it was going to be tight with when I was allowed to be streaming. And I shouldn't. I was under. It put me under pressure, and uh, you know, I played shit, and that was maybe one of the reasons why I played shit. He's really going uh, all in on this side, isn't he, here? Which should make it... I mean, he gets away from the tree, sure, but it makes it easy to well screen him. Wow, he's blitzing somebody who was already based and giving away a 3 2 dash block. Madman. God, that'd be amazing, wouldn't it? Six plus dodge. Bosh. Gotta base the blodgers. Make sure you base the people who can get away 35 times out of 36. Make sure you base them guys up. Just gonna have to go for two dice on the ball here, aren't I? Might get people surfed though. Fuck, he didn't even block with his guard guy. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And oh, no, I've gotta come around the back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, GFI. I guess they don't do that, and I guess I just screen. I disagree actually, Shawnee lad. I think it's a pretty good screen because um, he's he's boxed himself in on the sideline, hasn't he? Um, oh shit, he's got guard on him as well, fuck. He's not getting blocked for us, he is. Yeah, I think the screening is good when he's in your, when he's far in your half. I think that's when screening's best. No, Pedro Jack, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think my tree is a fan of standing up, to be honest. Sometimes he does, after, just straight after he's rooted, then he'll stand up. But yeah, it's not good relying on a 4 plus. I mean, he gets not. I put him on the line a lot, don't I? He just gets him knocked down a fair bit. I didn't even realise he had a troll, to be honest. Wow, blitzing with, blitzing with a loner. Yeah, I do need an Inarian tree, yeah. You can see why I like jump up on my uh, on my tree double. <laughs> Inarian doesn't have to deal with this like what I do. <laughs> Leap tree. <laughs> He's caged up. 
That's all I've got to do. Can't really one dice this, uh, this guy. Oh, wow. Hmm. He's strength two. So even if he gets two assists, it would only be a one D. He could get two assists, though. Right? Try to stand him up. He could two dice him. Then he could, could bring in two guys, one dice him. But then couldn't one dice the ball because of this guard. He could block him, he could chain him out. Doesn't help, does it? This is amazing with his two stuns. I should be able to do something from it, but I just can't see anything. I don't want to leap in. If I did leap in, I could push him there, which would be pretty good. Okay, just block people. I don't know what I do. I can't even block him because of him. I want to keep these guys tied up. Maybe just run around and block him. Face the ball. He's got a tackle shit. You can think of that. <laughs> the the team is full my blood team. So there you go. Yeah, exactly. You can't even base him because he'd just fucking pal me, wouldn't he? If I based him, he'd just been given up a two dice block on on my best player with tackle. It would be completely fucking ridiculously dumb thing to do. Oh, good wrestled. Get wrestled, dickhead. Pretty good, isn't it? Wrestle, to be honest, wrestle's pretty fucking good. Oh shit, I didn't get one dice in. Getting down to the nitty gritty now, won't it? How to keep the ball safe? Don't hit with your tackle, dude. Just hit with a mighty blow. I guess you can get some guard around him here, can't you? But the cage is going to be in contact, so he's he's got some problems. He's got some problems. No, oh, wrestle is good, man. Arise, right? wrestle is good. Obviously, I'm on lineman. It's four zero one jelly, so it's not like you make an audio. Okay, so he's just letting us hit hit the ball carrier. That's nice of him. Um, right, how do I get there? One, two, three. One, two, three, four. 
five, six, seven now. God. I could only just hit him without a tackle. That seems a bit pointless. Could wrestle him. So, stand him up, hit from there with wrestle with an assist. G5 from him, fuck it, let's go. Fucking time! I just can't make a two plus roll. <sighs> I, I know I could have moved the catcher. Right, that's it. I'm done. I'm done. I'm out. Sorry. I can't. I can't handle having the camera on. I thought I could handle face cam. It'll be a while before it comes back on. I can't handle it. I'm still pissed off. Sorry. Jesus fucking Christ.